Hi, it's Kathleen Packett here. And today I just want to expand on the topic of your vision. As we are coming to the close of 2013 and moving into another year ahead, that it's so important that we have a vision looking forward as to where we're going to be, what what we envision for ourselves in the months and the years to come. So as I was thinking about this, I got thought I wanted to look up inspirational people. And one of the people that I found was a lady named Admiral Grace Hopper. And what an amazing lady she was from back in the World War II era. She was the first person to... Um, work on first lady to work on the computers and she became the software queen is what they called her because her visions were so far um, reaching that she kept envisioning ahead and ahead and she changed the coding that was numerical into words the the cobalt um, programming that is used, still used by 70% of the programmers out there. The cool thing was is that she didn't retire from the Navy until she was 79 and a half years old. And at that time, she retired several times, but they kept putting her back into active duty because of her knowledge. And one of the gentlemen that you'll find a video underneath here of an interview, he wrote a book about her, was so astounding in the fact that when he first heard her, he was a 13-year-old boy speaking at his sister's um, graduation ceremony. And she was up in years at that time. But the thing that he remembered was that he thought, she's older. And most people of her age reflect on the past. But she never talked about the past. Her vision was always looking into the future and where the future was going to take them. That says so much about if you look back, you stop growing. If you look forward and you keep looking ahead and you keep growing and expanding on your creativity and where it can take you, put some thought into what your vision is, see yourself already completing that. So important that you get clear on that. I know I pound this home, but you want this next year, I'm sure, to be even better than your last year. And if you don't make changes, nothing, nothing in your life changes. You get the same results. She had, Admiral Hooper had a clock that she always kept on her wall that went counterclockwise and the numbers were backwards to remind herself that to embrace change and not to go with the same thought, we've always done it this way. Never to get caught up in that statement that will paralyze you. It will keep you where you're at if you do not think beyond what has already been done. So if you'd like to know more about me, check out my Facebook page, my blog, send me messages. would love to hear your comments and what you are looking forward to in the new year of 2014. <music>